Sanders is the chairman of the board and chief executive officer of Bloomin' Brands and is responsible for developing and executing their long-term objectives and strategies. She's a big picture thinker with exceptional instincts for introducing innovative ideas and strengthening brand and growing sales. Please join me in giving a very warm welcome to Liz. One of the most important leadership traits that you can have is to be a nimble, agile leader who is also capable and comfortable with ambiguity. If the last few years has taught us anything, okay, is there's no such thing as truly knowing what the future holds. Success will only come through the honest intersection of what you love and what you're good at. So as you go through your career, I just want to remind you always to follow your internal compass and resist being unduly influenced by what is trendy or pays best up front. I know it is tempting. If these are your true passions and your avenues, go for it. Go for it with gusto. But make sure it is truly your passion because I will tell you, if you want to make an impact, your best opportunity is to take your talent to corporate America. We need you desperately in corporate America. It's really important that we take the time to bring the next generations of leaders along and that we do our part to pave the way for women in leadership positions. We need to expand the number of women in C-suites and upper management. Um, my final thought is to remember to le live a 360 degree life, okay, and uh, um, you know, I just want to say one thing, and although I've had the privilege of having a really rewarding career that I love, I have a confession to make, my job is not the most important thing in my life. My family is. When work is not your whole life, it's very freeing and it allows you to make more objective, clear-headed decisions. It makes you a better leader. A passion for life outside the walls of the company has made me more creative, focused, and a better prioritizer. In closing, my hope for all of us is that as we continue on our journeys, is that we give ourselves permission to figure out our lives as they unfold, and that we have the confidence to know that we are resilient and never hold ourselves back from pursuing our dreams. And if we do that, regardless of the outcome, we will know that we have lived a meaningful life and in the process, hopefully, made it a bit easier for those that follow. So thank you for giving me the opportunity to speak. There is an unmistakable bond that exists between women. Uh, it's really hard to describe. It sounds a little hokey to you guys. But I know it exists and it draws us to one another. It's not friendship, but it's kinship. I will never again be in an environment where I'm around this number of high-powered women. But what I've recently realized is that many of my mentors are in this room right now and will likely to continue to be my mentors going forward. And I really don't want this connection uh, to be lost once we leave this campus. So I take personal responsibility for maintaining my connections with the individuals that I've met here at the GSB, but I also take personal responsibility for maintaining our group connection. So with that, we conclude this, uh, this spectacular banquet. Thank you very much. Thank you all.